One more time for Set Free. When I shook this gentleman's hand five minutes ago, his fingers were longer. <laughs> oh man, that's gotta be hard on the finger, slapping that thing like that, but he does a mighty fine job on that. Again, the ladies' auxiliaries have all kinds of food up there. My wife and I just took some of the ate some of their barbecue chicken. It is very good. So get yourself up there to the top of the hill if you can, and if not, we'll get your hands and and get the, some of the ladies to come down here and get your name and number. Um, yeah, they got barbecue chicken, all kinds of burgers, baked goods, fruit cup, all kinds of drinks, iced teas, and they got some ice cream and gelatis over here on the side. French fries over here by the side of that building up there. So go ahead, help yourself. But don't all leave at once. We don't want to empty out the tent. Hmm. Again, thank Blue Lake Builders and uh, Mary Groff and Sons for sponsoring this event here with us. Hi. This will be the the last group for this first set. And I need to make a correction up on the brochures and flyers that have been sitting out, going out around all the grocery stores and all kinds of stores around the area. We had them listed as the Werner family band. It still is the Werner boys, some of them, but it's no longer the Werner family band. They changed their name to Aaronwood Drive. So you're looking at Aaronwood Drive here tonight, not Werner family band, but uh, uh, they've, they've been doing a, a good job. I remember seeing them my first time down here in Ephrata. That's when the, I think uh, Silas, you're the youngest of the boys, right? He's not here. He's not here. Well, he's not even here. Yeah, yeah. No, no, see, that's what we did. <laughs> oh, that's what made him change. <laughs> see, I, I, yeah, I remember when he was, he was like nine or ten or something when you guys started playing. And uh, so it's, it's good to watch you guys come up the ranking. <laughs> Check, check one, check one, two. We do not want to hurt anybody's ears, but we do want you to feel this bluegrass, not just hear it. Okay. You guys are ready. Now listen, guys, I, I got to tell you this. You know, if you want to come back next week, you're going to have to, you're going to, have to play hard. All right. Well, let's let's have it, okay? I got you. All right. Okay. Hey, make welcome Aaronwood Bluegrass. Woo!
thank you all so much. How's everyone doing out there? We're all good? All right. Yeah, well, it's great to be here. Uh, it's always not a beautiful day. We weren't sure coming into this what it was going to be like. But it's just awesome to see the sunshine and see all these faces. So, yeah, we got some songs to play for you today. Again, we are Ironwood Drive. Uh, prior the have been known as the Werner Family Band. Some new faces, uh, we'll introduce them as we go along today. Uh, but now we got another song for you, we're gonna follow suit. Uh, this is an old Jim and Jesse tune. This one's called, Are You Lost in Sin? Leave me alone, 
it's going to be an appropriate song for today, uh, considering the status of the forecast, but hey, we're going to play it anyway, so, alright, so, just checking in again, sounds all good out there, everything's good, alright, perfect, that's what we like to see, uh, we're going to keep on moving here, uh, this next song um, is one, I'm going to slow it down just a bit, the guitarist is going to take lead on that, and while we're speaking of him, I might as well go ahead and introduce the first person here, please welcome Brett Byler on the guitar. He does a real fine job there. Uh, today he is accompanied by a guest. I guess I will refrain from introducing her, but uh, I'm sure she'll be happy to talk to y'all afterwards. This next song is called Another Soldier Down. It's got some color in his face. <laughs> All, right. <laughs> All right, this next song, did you say what the next song is? All right, he said what the next song is. We'll just go ahead and play it then. We're in a mighty conflict here The army of the Lord We must join forces standing tall And lean upon His word The enemy Uh, the bass player to you here. 
How about a hand for Brandon Fox? Brandon's a fine young man and does a great job in the upright bass. Um, he uh, is in charge of coordinating our, our shows and where we're going to be and making sure we're all there on time. And sometimes that works, sometimes that doesn't. But anyway, last week, we had, or two weeks ago, somebody forgot their instrument when they came to practice. So that, uh, yeah, sort of threw a monkey wrench into things. But hey, it's all good. Not me. Yeah, it wasn't Gideon. I, no. Come on, Gideon. All right. Speaking of him, he's going to play an instrument for you that he wrote, and it's called World's End. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, it's, it's a common theme. 
common theme, all right. But yeah, he does a real fine job and uh, definitely brings some freedom this, to the group, that's for sure. So um, yeah, we're gonna let him uh, sing this song, which is relatively new for us. And in fact, it's on a new project, which we'll talk more about here in a minute. But this song is called Two Coats. tonight. Is it tonight? Yes, yeah, I guess so, this afternoon. We're going to sing a song that we've never sung on stage before for y'all, and uh, this one is called Traveling the Highway Home. And yeah, we're still trying to figure out how we're going to play it. Yeah. 
Introduce is actually the newest member to the band, and uh, how about a hand for Jordan B. Deliver here? <laughs> Jordan comes all the way from Kirkwood, Pennsylvania, and uh, <laughs> one time we were at a show, and Brandon was like, he was introducing, was like, yeah, and Jordan's from Fleetwood, Pennsylvania. We were like, what? Close. It was close, but he's from Kirkwood. Anyway, he. Uh, when was the first time he picked up a mandolin? Late May is when he picked up a mandolin, and uh, here he is doing his thing. So uh, <laughs> we got lucky with this one. <laughs> he does a really good job, and uh, as we integrate him in the band more, we'll get him to sing and do some of that stuff. He is singing already, but uh, he's going to take lead one of these days. So, All right, we're going to play a song that, that we played for quite a while, but uh, it's, it's always a good song and uh, has a good message. Uh, you played this song? So it seen. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's called Lord Bless His House. Yeah, nothing to change. Lord bless this house with peace and love forever. Uh, some of those old songs that uh, Brett and a lot of the rest of us uh, really 
love to hear uh, the intricate harmonies of. So, whenever you're ready. spent some time in Asheville, North Carolina, recording that project, and uh, we actually have it along today. It'll be back at our table, we would love to talk to y'all afterwards. It's also on Spotify, iTunes, wherever you find your music. So, uh, yeah, we're super excited about that and happy to share that with y'all. So, yeah, whenever everyone's ready, we'll do this song. This is called Why Did I Wait So Long?
from and uh, we'd like to play their songs here. Uh, this one is called There is a Time. As soon as the banjo is in tune. There's a time between the banjo and the song.
much faster, but that's okay. We have fun with it. <laughs> All right. Well, it's been great to be here, and again, we will be back later. Some more uh, great musicians coming up here. So going to let you all with one more song. Uh, this is an instrumental that we haven't played in a while, and uh, we were practicing it backstage, one you're probably familiar with. Uh, this one's called Theme Time. I'm going to try to keep this one on the rails as best we can. Don't kill us, all right? No, no. Lame to the stuff. <laughs> oh man, that's good stuff. Hey, give another hand for for the uh, Ironwood Drive. Thanks a lot, guys. You are.